right, Nick. It is considered one of the leading African American history museums in the country. But tonight, the Charles H. Wright Museum is drawing fire from some. A group of activists, artists, and community leaders are coming forward saying the museum needs new leadership, and that's not all. Jamie Edmonds is live, and Jamie, there are issues with an upcoming exhibit as well. Yes, absolutely, Kimberly. That group is actually offended by an upcoming exhibit, while the museum tells me tonight it may be a misunderstanding. We question the direction of the leadership. Tahira Ahmad and Abdul Akil are members of the Coalition for Black Legacy. It's a group of about 20 community organizations. These are people who helped put the Charles H. Wright, H. Wright Museum together. We supported Dr. Wright. But now this coalition feels the Charles H. Wright Museum is heading in the wrong direction. It started with the departure of former CEO Juanita Moore this summer, but the group is calling an upcoming exhibit of President Thomas Jefferson's plan a slap in the face. The Jefferson exhibit is like bringing Hitler to the Holocaust Museum and trying to make Hitler not look as bad. So the coalition wrote to the board asking for three things. Number one, we ask that community representatives be added to the museum board. Number two, we ask that community representatives be included on the committee for the selection of the new CEO. And number three, we voiced our opposition to an exhibit that features Thomas Jefferson plantation. Ahmad says the museum board responded with denials, and now the group is holding this press conference to appeal to the community for support. But for the African, African American community, it must be therapeutic, and we must all have a say so in how that memory will be uh, uh, institutionalized and memorialized. Now, I spoke with the museum just a little bit ago, and they say the upcoming exhibit is called Paradox of Liberty, and it will tell the stories of Sally Hemings, which was an enslaved woman, and other families on that plantation from their perspective. So they think maybe this group might have a misunderstanding of what that exhibit is actually about. When it comes to the community involvement, I was told I would get a, a statement from the museum, and as of this airing, I haven't heard on that aspect of things. Live in Detroit, Jamie Edmonds, Local 4.